praise the lord everyone eppadi irukinga i hope everyone is in good health we meet again for this bible meditation so before we start let's pray let's close our eyes let's pray heavenly father we want to thank you for this time that you have given us to come together as one in your name o lord jesus father especially we want to thank you for the children who are here today who are listening to this bible meditation Lord I pray that you bless them that you help them to understand and to be able to apply this in their lives Lord Jesus commit them fully unto your hands and we ask all this in Jesus name amen okay let's continue okay so before we go into this week's bible meditation let's look at the previous week's one na huh? so jaba and shina are you ready Okay so the first question vandu where is the memory verse taken from so idu vandu it is taken from Deuteronomy chapter 6 verse 5 and it says love the lord with all your heart soul and strength okay so that was the first question and then the second question what are the three ways to put god first okay so the first way is to pray second read the bible third talk about god okay so these are the three ways idu tha and the moon ways three ways that we can put god first pray jabipadu read the bible uh, bible padikirathu and talk about god jesus pathi ellathiyo pesirathu okay so this was for last previous weeks bible meditation about putting god first சரியா ஓகே இப்போ இதுக்கு அப்புறம் வந்து ஒன்று செகண்ட் வீடியோ வரும் ஸோ இந்த வீடியோ வந்து நல்லா கேளுங்க ஜபா அண்ட் ஷீனா லிசன் கேர்ஃபுல்லி அண்ட் ஆஃப்டர் தட் ஆன்சர் த டூ கொஷன்ஸ் அட் அட் த நெக்ஸ்ட் ஸ்லைட் அண்ட் தென் ப்ளீஸ் சென்ட் டு அன்டி லேட்டஸ்ட் பை தேர்ஸ்டே ஓகே ஜபா அண்ட் ஷீனா கேனா குட் கேர்ள்ஸ் ஓகே ஆல் ரைட் டேக் பேக் யூ ஹே கிட்ஸ் டுடே வர்க் நான் டாக் அபவுட் அனதர் கிட் பேசிக் The second thing you need to know to survive as a kid. Let's talk about obedience. Get ready. What are some of the rules in your house? Clean your room, take out the garbage, do your homework, no fighting. Maybe you don't like rules. I don't always either. But you know what? Obeying our parents is really important. We should do it for two reasons. First, we should obey God because the Bible says so. Our memory verse says, "Obey your parents for this pleases the Lord." Now, if you don't have a parrot, you can always obey your dog or your cat. No, not your parrot. your parents obey your parents oh that makes more sense now i don't know about you but if obeying your parents pleases god then that's what i want to do so we're done right that's it obey your parents because the bible says so no there's another reason we should also obey our parents for our protection let me demonstrate with this hula hoop This is a big O for obedience. Think of obeying like staying inside the boundaries, you know, inside the circle. Stay inside the boundaries your parents have set and you are safe. Step outside the circle and the masked menace will get you. So, one time my mom told me to do my homework, but I really wanted to watch my favorite TV show. And another time my parents told me to stop bugging my sister, but she just looks so lonely. And when my dad asked me to take out the garbage, I kind of got distracted on the way. Get the idea? Just obey. It's for your protection. And one more thing. If you want to survive and win as a kid, then don't forget the ice. It's a simple way to remember how to obey. We should obey immediately. cheerfully and exactly so kids don't forget obey your parents